gotcha. Whoa. Oh. Ah, sh huh? I can't concentrate. Sorry, Mr. Bear. How strange. Bear should already be hibernating. Hibernating? Yes. To survive winter's shortage of food, bears go to sleep. That's why they eat so much during the warm season. Hush! Could I have a bit of silence, please? He's really nervous. So, if we give Bear my biscuits, then will he fall asleep? We can try it. Let's go in. Good morning, Mr. Bear. Sorry to disturb you. What's the matter? We noticed that you haven't started hibernating. No, I can't sleep. So what? You know, we believe that you can't sleep because you're hungry. So we brought you some biscuits. Well, they certainly can't do me any harm. Mm. Yum, yum. So? What do you think? You're right. I am hungry. What else is there to eat? Hmm, nothing else. But we can go and find you some other food. Oh, yes, yes, great. But be quick. In the meantime, I'll set the table and prepare my bed. Bear is really hungry. We must find a lot of food. I could ask Mummy Mouse for help. Good idea. I'll go and get something from my place. Here is a nice carrot pie <laughs> offered by Mummy Mouse. Wow, this smells yummy. Here is the second course, raisins. Ooh, what a treat. Thank you. <laughs> yum, yum. Shh. It seems he has fallen asleep. Dessert! What? I can't sleep. I need dessert. Lunch is not complete without dessert. I brought something that you're gonna like a lot. Toasted bread with forest honey. Mmm, how delicious. Mmm, <laughs> mmm. La 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 la. Excuse me, Mrs. Duck, are you missing one of your babies by any chance? Oh, I sure hope not. Quick, go count your brothers and sisters. Quack! Nope, I've got all my babies. Okay, thanks anyway, Mrs. Duck. Quack! Don't worry, little duckling. We'll find your family. I promise. The question is, where? Maybe we should look on the other side. What do you think? Quack, quack. Wonderful. Let's go. Quack, quack. Poor thing. It's okay, little duckling. You'll be all right. Come on, let's sing. Singing a happy tune makes troubles go away. Quack. Singing a happy tune cheers up a gloomy day. Quack. I always sing a happy tune when I'm singing with you. Look, here's another duck family. I'm sorry to disturb you, Mrs. Duck. This baby duckling is lost, and I'm trying to find his family. Is he yours? Quack, quack, quack. Quack, quack, quack. No, no. This little duckling isn't one of mine. But I think I know his mother. She lives on the other side of that pond. Thank you very much, Mrs. Duck. Quick, little duckling, let's go. Quack, quack. Listen, I think your mother is over there. Let's swim across. Quack. Hey, wait. Don't swim so fast. Quack, quack. Quack, quack. Quack, quack. Quack, quack. quack. It is your mother. I knew it. Thank you for finding my little duckling. We were so worried. Oh, you're welcome. Quack! Quack, quack! Quack, quack! Oh, I'm happy too, little duckling. You're finally back with your family. Quack! Oh, lovely ripe strawberries. Chuck! Hmm, I'm sure I heard something. Chuck! <laughs> Two eyes? Strawberries don't have eyes. Chuck. A talking strawberry? Who are you? 
Chuck! Oh, what an odd lizard. Sue, look how many acorns we've got. Wow! <laughs> Did you hear that? I heard something moving. Must have been the wind. Yes. <laughs> there it is again. Ah, oh, it's just an acorn. Rolling off the pile. Chuck! Chuck! Did you hear that? It's not an acorn. Something's hiding in the pile. Let's go and see. You're not an acorn. What are you? Chuck. Chuck. What, what a, a funny, funny lizard. lizard. Chuck. 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 Did you meet Chuck, too? Yes. A very strange lizard. Very strange. So you saw him, too, Mophie? Yes. The reddest lizard I've ever seen. Red? He was green. Red? Green? Chuck is... Brown! Brown? He's strawberry red. Red? He's green like a leaf. Brown! Red, red, red. Green! Chuck! <laughs> Chuck! Phew. Chuck! Oh, I know. Chuck is a very clever lizard called a chameleon. <laughs> a chameleon can change color. It's called camouflage. He changes color to match the background so that he is hard to see. On red, he becomes red. On green, he becomes green. And on brown, he becomes brown. So we were all right. Yes, you were. Hey, my new song can be about Chuck. Oh. What's that bright light? Is that you, Carrie? Yes, your, your light dazzled me. Carrie, can you help us? We are searching for my postman's cap. We think a magpie's taken it. A magpie? Of course I'll help you. Follow the shiny mirror. Wow! What a beautiful shiny mirror! Please, can I have it? It's so beautiful! It could be a shiny present! Or I could just borrow it for a week or two or three or four or maybe never give it back or I could give it back. I don't know. Please! Please! I can't resist anything shiny! Like the badge on my cap? Your cap? My cap is missing. I did find a cap! Oh, with such a bright shiny badge! Just lying on a stone. Could it be yours? Yes, it could. I am so sorry. I didn't know it was yours. <gasps> Follow me. Wow. Oh my. So many this shiny things. things. With my cap on top. Okay, you can have it back. Back where it belongs. Up here on my head. <laughs> it is a beautiful collection, but you should be more careful not to take other people's things, even if they are shiny. I'll try to be more careful next time. I don't want to upset anybody. It's okay. Mogu has his cap back, and you found new friends. Right? Right! Silly Billy. Oh, Silly Billy. You're the Silly Billy. But... Oh. but... Hi, Mogu. Are you coming to Carrie's for tea tomorrow? I'm a bit busy today, but tomorrow should be fine. See you then. Bye. Bye, Mofi. Lazy bones. Oh, Mogu, that's not nice, calling me a lazy bones. But, Mofi, it wasn't me. Hi, Sora. Are you going home from school? Yes, we've just finished. How is school now? It's much better, thank you. I have to go now, Carrie. Bye. Bye, Sora. <laughs> silly Billy. Carrie, I am not Billy, and I am not silly. Sora, I didn't say you were. Honestly. Who was it, then? What's the matter, Mophie? Moon, do you think I'm a lazy bones? Of course not. Mogu said I was. Surely not. There must be some mistake. I can't believe Mogu would say something like that. 
Talk to him tomorrow, Mofi. I'm sure you can sort it out. I will, Moon. Thank you. Mofi! Mofi! Hello, Mogu. Mofi, you know how you thought I called you Lazy Bones yesterday? It wasn't me. And the same thing happened between Carrie and Sora. So, we're going to meet at the playground to work out what's going on. Let's go! My friends, something odd is happening. Sora thought I called her Silly Billy, but it wasn't me. And someone called me Lazy Bones. I thought it was Mogu, but it wasn't. Someone is having great fun teasing us. Who would be so naughty, Carrie? Uh, uh, naughty, naughty. Uh, uh, uh. Lazy Bones. Uh, naughty Carrie. Lazy Bones, Lazy Bones. Silly Billy. Uh, lazy Bones. Naughty, naughty. Don't call me names. Don't call me names. <laughs> oh, it's a parrot. He's been calling us names because parrots love to repeat the words they hear. <laughs> 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 <laughs>